Look at that flame shirt you got on. <laughs> Holy cow, he's, he's got the whole works going for him. <laughs> got flames on his car, flames on his shirt. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, that's pretty. This is Mike Hall. I want you to tell me about your car. The whole, you know, like where you found it, how you built it. Let's, Thir let's walk over here and get you in front of it. 1932 Rockney. Now what the heck is a Rockney? Never heard of it. Named after Newt Rockney, the football player in the 30s. Um, basically, Studebaker owned the company just like they did Pierce Arrow. Um, I was sitting behind the guy's garage I was working at. Pretty rough shape. When I got it home, everybody said, well, you're not going to get that thing fixed up. But there it is. So. <laughs> How many years you spend on it? Well, I've had it around 18 years, I think, total. What, what kind of shape? Going work in progress. What kind of shape was it in when you, when you brought it home? No roof. Missing about six inches along. All the rocker panels were gone except for a little bit on one side. About six inches up the cowling, one side gone. No floor pans. Uh, frame pretty well intact. No rear end, no front end. I suppose. No motor. What'd you use for front end? Super bell draw axle. Yeah. Tubular. I think it cost there. Those original springs? Original springs, yeah. Yeah, and what about the rear end? Camaro. And the motor? Uh, 1988, 305, high output. 700 R4 training. You did all the work yourself? Yeah. You painted it? Yeah. Did all the body work? You must have had to make the, the, the lower part of the car if it was all right yeah. out. I had just enough to, so I could tell what it looked like, so. Mm hmm 16 gauge full boards in it now. Yeah, who did the interior? I did. You did the interior? Yeah. What's What there is, I still need more of it. Yeah. Done everything. Wire. <laughs> <laughs> I remember seeing this car back about the time you started, but I believe, because I remember you were in your garage working on it years and years and years ago. That's awesome. This part right here was completely gone. Yeah. And it was sagging to the point where this door was sticking out that far because it was starting to lose all its structure. Yeah. So I had to like clamp up the whole body and get this welded in and then hope, hope that it would hold together what you did. Yeah. <laughs> I like your Clay Smith cam stickers on here. I mean, uh, that's what I got in the floorboard of mine. I always did like that. I like that little emblem there. And I got my wrap thing on the back and then I got up here. I got the great big lady luck stickers, but <laughs> <laughs> that's wicked cool. Going touch point eyeball, I made that. Yeah, you made the eyeball. Uh, you made the eyeball. Yeah, my buddy's a taxidermist, so he gave me an eyeball. <laughs> <laughs> I said, "What am I going to do with this thing? I made that." <laughs> that's great. That's a beautiful car, Mike.